Students at Clinton High School staged a walkout today after first period. Now this after a confrontation Friday after the school's football game involving a black student and an officer. Tennis reporter Malik Jackson takes us to that protest and explains why the students call what happened Friday a breaking point. As a student body, we see that we have recognized that equality is the only thing that we will stand for. And today made us have a little bit of a breakthrough on to how to get towards walking to equality. A stand by students who say they've had enough. It was just the final nail in the block of wood that split it. We were tired of everything that was happening, but it does play a big part because it shows to a, a more of a public eye what goes on. The walkout stemmed from a confrontation Friday. The details are unclear, but video on social media shows a confrontation between an officer and a black student. At one point, the video shows that student on the ground. The sheriff's office says they are investigating, and the director of schools, Tim Parrott, says he's proud of his students for taking a stand. I really, I really am proud of our student body. Uh, they've done a, they, they saw there was a problem. Uh, they did a walkout. It was an orderly walkout. But now they, now they know that's just the first part of it. That was Malik Jackson reporting. And again, at, tonight at 6, we will hear a statement from the family of that boy and where they want to see this case move from here.